today to finally take this knife I made out of a uh, railroad spike and I'm gonna harden it in oil. I bought some, uh, just got some cheap uh, motor oil and uh, put it in a can and I'm gonna heat this up to uh, you know red hot and I'm gonna dip the blade in to harden it. Uh, so we'll hope that works out. I think it uh, turned out pretty good. <laughs> I'm learning as I go though and uh, so we'll see how this happens. I don't know, uh, I left it pretty thick here on the spine. I don't know if you could see that. And uh, also, I didn't really sharpen the blade down too much either because I'm afraid it's going to warp uh, in, if I got it down too thin and then tried to harden it uh, from the fire into the, into the oil. So we'll give that a try too and see how that works. All right, I think it's ready. Yeah, that's what it looks like. It was nice looking before. <laughs> now I got to clean it all off again, and, and hopefully there's no cracks or warps. Doesn't look like it. Looks like it's still straight. I don't know if you could see it. So we'll clean that up on the wire wheel and uh, let's finish up the the sharpening of the edge. Hey guys, so. I annealed the blade, I put it in my oven at uh, 400 degrees for two hours. And I got this nice, uh, hard probably to see, I don't know, uh, sort of a straw color. Bring it back a little bit, soften it up. Now I'm just going to put the finishing touches on it with the grinder and the sander. Get a nice sharp blade on it.